the 50s. It was very nice out there today. And all week long, we're going to be seeing the temperatures that will be either at your location, it'll be close to 50 or over 50 degrees all the way through until Saturday. The difference for tomorrow, we're going to add some rain into the equation. It's going to show you what's happening right now. You can see the temperature still quite mild out there in the 40s. West Mifflin right now at 44 degrees. Uniontown 44. We're currently at 41 in Pittsburgh, 43 Cranberry, and 34 in Butler. You take a little further look out, you can see down south in Charleston, West Virginia, 48 degrees. Washington, D.C. at 48. Louisville currently at 50 degrees. Right now, downtown, 41 degrees. Winds are absolutely calm. Relative humidity at 65% with a dew point at 30 degrees. That's pretty dry. We take a look at the high temperature from earlier today, 52 degrees with the sunshine, and that was six above the average of 46. This morning, we dropped down to 35 degrees, and that's also well above the average of 28. As we head into tomorrow, we'll see temperatures that will drop down. I think they'll get down to about the mid 30s, and then they'll bounce back up closer to 50 degrees tomorrow. Some locations in the upper 40s, but many others will make it into the low 50s as well. Let's take a look at what's happening right now. We have the clouds that have already moved across the region, and that's just going to increase as we head through tomorrow. This is what's on the way. Massive area of rain, a rain shield moving up from the south. We're tapping into that Gulf moisture. There's low pressure down here, and that's going to push all of this up into Pennsylvania as we head into tomorrow. You'll see it right here on Futurecast as this moves a little. Bit closer. We're going to see all that rain moving across Pennsylvania. Stopped at Tuesday at 4 o'clock, and then we take it into Wednesday. That will move off to the east, and we're going to have high pressure that will build in late on Wednesday. So skies will actually clear out once we get towards the end of the day on Wednesday, and the high pressure will be with us on Thursday as well. That will be a very nice day. As we take a look at tomorrow morning, 8 o'clock, we have clouds across the board. By noontime, that's when I anticipate the rain will be across the area. Now, further south, you could see those rain showers moving in by the mid morning. Will be with us through the day. That's 5 o'clock on Tuesday. Day. And then by 10 o'clock from Pittsburgh South, we'll see the rain, but it'll quickly start to move out of the region. Wednesday morning, with all that moisture, we'll have the leftover clouds, possibly a little bit of fog in the morning on Wednesday. But by the time we get to the afternoon and evening, you see how it clears out nicely with that high pressure. And we take it into Thursday, just a few clouds around in the morning. We go into the afternoon, and it's going to be a very nice day. As far as how much rain we're going to be seeing for the south, you are, better chance you'll have of getting closer to an inch of rain. But most locations, I think, are looking about a quarter to a half an inch of rain with this moving through. So 37 degrees tomorrow morning, mostly cloudy, high temperature of 52 degrees with those widespread rain showers. In your town, this is your high temperature. Uniontown, 53 degrees, 50 in Somerset, Greensburg, 52, 49 in Oil City, Butler at 50, Newcastle, 50 in Beaver, 51 degrees, low 50s for Washington and Wheeling, Brownsville, 53, and a high in Wexford of 51, South Hills, 53. Now, as we go through the rest of the week, temperatures will be at or above 50 degrees in Pittsburgh. Thursday going to be a very nice day with only a few clouds around. Friday will start dry, but we'll finish with some rain showers moving in. Same type of system, low pressure coming up from the Gulf will bring in that moisture, and that means rain on Saturday will be likely. Could linger around until early on Sunday, but then we clear it out once again with more sunshine returning with high pressure.